Imagine trying to cook a really complicated dish, something that you've never cooked before and I don't give you the list of ingredients or the utensils that you'll need or the tools that you'll need like the oven or the gas stuff or any other equipment that you'll need nor do I give you the recipe. I just tell you give me the finished product. How would you feel? I don't know about you, just thinking about it makes me nervous, makes me feel really unsettled. But what's the connection of that with today's episode? People at large are trying to unlock the abundance using the law of attraction, using the tools of financial literacy, but without having to try and understand how exactly does the process work. In the future episodes, I may talk to you about the process of how to unlock the abundance using financial literacy. But in today's episode, I'm going to tell you about the five most common mistakes that people are making that's causing the entire law of attraction practice to go completely haywire and it's literally leading to zero or delayed results. Get ready because you're going to get a lot of reality checks in today's episode. You're also going to get a lot of perspective, but at the end of it, you'll get ideas which will make you overcome these mistakes once and for all. In fact, towards the end of the episode, I can almost guarantee that you will find a completely different way to approach the practice of law of attraction. So get started. Hello and welcome to episode 3 of Unlock the Abundance, a podcast by Paycheck to Profit, a community created for millennials and Gen Zs to change their relationship with money, Who, for millennials and Gen Zs who are wanting to get into the whole concept of financial literacy, who want to learn how to unlock the abundance step by step. I'm Manish Aoja, your financial abundance coach, founder of Paycheck to Profit and your host for the day. A quick reminder that this episode is uh, is available both in audio and video format. So just in case if you're watching us on YouTube, do not forget to subscribe to Unlock the Abundance on all favorite podcast applications of your choice. And if you're listening to us on the favorite application of your choice, you you can also watch this and all the rest of the episodes of Unlock the Abundance on the official YouTube channel of Paycheck to Profit. So let's get started and tell you about the first step or the first mistake that people are doing. The first reason why law of attraction is not working for most people is literally the core reason. It's intermittent belief. One of the core principles of law of attraction to work is that you have to have full faith and belief in the system of the law of attraction. Law of attraction at large is very simple. More often than not, it is too simplistic for people to even believe in the efficacy of the law of attraction, which makes people skeptical, which makes people overthink, which makes people think this cannot be possible. So they try looking for various complicated mechanisms and methods. That's not needed. You don't manifest what you need or you don't manifest what you want. You actually manifest what you are. To make law of attraction work for you, the only thing that you have to work upon is is on yourself. Instead of focusing on trying to look for different tools, different mechanisms, different tricks, try focusing on getting more clarity, getting more perspective and start working on yourself and become a better version of yourself, which will make you achieve what you are manifesting. The second reason why people are actually ending up not manifesting or the mistake that they are making is they're trying to manifest in secrecy or they're trying to manifest exclusively. By that I mean one of the most effective ways to manifest is to find yourself a community. A lack of community is a very common reason why people keep overthinking and get stuck in all the possible reasons of doubt. If you have a community where you can connect with people, where you can discuss situations with people, where you can get more clarity on other people's breakthroughs, the mechanisms that they use for their manifestations, you will get a lot of ideas, you will get a lot of perspective, you will get a lot of clarity on what you are missing out on or possibly what mechanisms can you apply in your manifestation practice. Having access to a community is one of the fastest ways to actually start manifesting all of your goals. So I would recommend you to find yourself a community on ASAP basis. For that matter of fact, let me make your job easier. Let me invite you to a community. The community is called Profit Clan. It's an online community or email community for all profit heads of Paycheck to Profit. You'll get a lot of updates on the new episodes, updates on the freebies that Uh, I create or are getting created in the Paycheck to Profit community, you'll also get a snapshot of breakthroughs of people within the community. You'll see how people in the Paycheck to Profit Academy are getting more progress in their law of attraction practice. 
you'll find the link to join the profit clan in the show notes below please make sure that you become a part of the profit clan it's absolutely free for you and you'll get updates on regular basis you'll also get updates to the profit masterclass and join the profit clan today because the clan literally feels incomplete without you the third reason why people are not being able to manifest in their life is because they have intermittent understanding of the tools and practices of the law of attraction the law of attraction has multiple tools like affirmation vision boards goal cards goal writing so on and so forth however to use these tools correctly you must know the purpose the usage of every tool and when to use them using the wrong tool to get your results is only going to lead to a lot of frustration let me give you a simple example you cannot tighten a screw using a spanner a spanner is a fabulous tool it's a very functional tool but it can only be used to with nuts and bolts however if you're trying to use a spanner to tighten a screw you're only going to make a mess out of it you're going to get irritated and it is not going to lead to your results similarly your journaling is a tool your goal cards are a tool your there are so many tools that you have to be more mindful about and without having any understanding of how these tools work if you're just using these tools blindly you're only going to lead to a lot of more confusion for that matter of fact this is one of the prime reasons why i have created this program called law of attraction step by step which is access of which is given in the paycheck to profit academy to know more about law of attraction step by step a 10 step method to actually apply law of attraction for your money your wealth and unlock the abundance you will have to attend the profit master class and how do you get to know about the profit master class i have already given you the access to it when you sign up for the profit clan so please do not forget to sign up for the profit clan and you'll find the link in the show notes the fourth reason why people are not being able to manifest using law of attraction is intermittent practice now what is that simple this is sort of self explanatory you cannot practice affirmations and then forget about it for two weeks you cannot start journaling today and then feel bored about it or feel that no this journaling isn't helping and not get back to your journal for three weeks or three months same is the case with goal card vision board law of attraction is a very systematic process it's actually a routine that you have to commit to if you would like to know about my law of attraction routine i would recommend you to go and comment the word routine in the comments below it's just one word it will take 5 seconds but it will let me know that more and more people are wanting to know about the information of how to set up a law of attraction routine and if sharing my routine helps you i'll be more than happy to share it with you if you are listening to this episode on a podcast application you'll find the link to the youtube video in the show notes click on that link it will take you to the youtube video and may, do not forget to comment the word routine you can also ask me questions with regards to law of attraction money mindset money blocks financial literacy in the comments below so do not forget to ask your questions and give me the word routine in the comments section the fifth and the biggest reason why people are not being able to manifest the biggest mistake that people are doing in the whole concept of the law of attraction is that they are completely overwhelmed and they are completely confused because they lack a lot of clarity now what happens is you want to manifest something your energy towards manifesting has become as reached to such a point that there's very little difference between your energy of manifestation and desperation in this energy of desperation what people are trying to do is that they're trying to look for multiple videos multiple podcasts multiple books or articles on law of attraction to manifest the same thing now what will happen is you'll find multiple content creators sharing multiple points of views based on what has worked for them in the past what based on their law of attraction understanding based on their practice now that is only going to cause a lot of confusion overwhelm and it will only lead to more lack of clarity in your mind to actually lead your manifestation journey the first step that you need to get to is absolute clarity on what you're looking for let me very quickly give you a summary and recap of all the five points that i have mentioned in this episode and then i'll tell you how you can actually convert all of this confusion to a far more superior practice intermittent belief which is causing you to not understand how are these tools working lack of community do not forget to become a part of the profit clan community to get yourself in, enrolled into a free community today itself lack of understanding of how these tools work intermittent practice you cannot just practice some aspects of law of attraction as per your wish and then forget about the routine you have to create a routine and 
प्लीज डू नॉट गेट ओवर वेन बाय कंज्यूमिंग अ लॉट ऑफ कॉन्टेंट फाइंड योर सेल्फ वन और टू कॉन्टेंट क्रिएटर्स पीपल हु यू रेजोनेट विद पीपल हुज वॉइस कॉल्स आउट टू यू एंड देन फॉलो दैम एंड फॉलो वट दे आर ट्राइंग टू टेल यू इफ यू लिसन टू दिस एपिसोड टू दिस पॉइंट आई जेन्यूनली सजेस्ट दैट यू मेक श्योर दैट यू आर सब्सक्राइब टू द पॉडकास्ट यू आर ऑल्सो सब्सक्राइब टू द YouTube channel of Paycheck to Profit and do not forget to follow us on Instagram I keep posting a lot of behind the scenes a lot of content a lot of context and a lot of stories on the Instagram channel of Paycheck to Profit so make sure you follow us on all the platforms you'll find links of all the platforms where Paycheck, Paycheck to Profit is active in the show notes below at the end of the episode let me revisit the claim that I made at the start of the episode I told you this episode is going to give you so much perspective that you will start looking at your law of attraction differently you will get a lot of new thought processes to think about you will get a lot of knowledge to introspect about let me know if i have lived up to my promise let me know in the uh, comments below and if you need more perspective if you need more clarity on any of the topics that i have spoken about I will be more than happy to answer your questions in the comment section. So let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you have liked this episode, if this episode has added value to you, I strongly recommend you to go back to the episode one of this series. The title of that episode was Five Requirements to Get Your Manifestation to Get Quick Results. It is literally like having a checklist to manifest all of your results, manifest all of your desires in a very quick manner. do not forget to check that episode again the link of that episode will be given in the show notes below thank you so much for listening to this episode till the end i really appreciate your commitment towards your personal growth and towards your learning do not forget to support this episode by just liking this episode on youtube or if you're listening to us on a podcast application of your choice please give us a five star five mics five hearts whatever the interface of your podcast application allows you to do do not forget to subscribe to the profit clan and get updates from paycheck to profit delivered directly to your inbox if you did not make any notes i would recommend you to re-listen to this episode after a couple of days because now that you know the content of this episode when you re-listen to the episode you'll get a lot deeper and a lot more meaningful perspective out of the same content if you don't believe me do listen to this episode again and let me know if that works i really appreciate your company and i cannot wait to connect with you again Please take good care of yourself keep smiling keep going keep growing